Yesterday I made a video about once saved, always saved, and there's a brother who left me a message. And he told me that whenever he discusses this doctrine with once saved, always saved believers, some of them will come back and say, if somebody keeps living in sin, that means they were never saved to begin with. This brother asked me what I think about that statement, what I think we should answer uh, to people who say it. I've personally heard that statement many times, and I personally have my own response to it. But first, I want to say that mostly that is true. Most people who think they are born again, saved Christians, are not born again. And that is proven because they are living in deliberate sin all the time. They have never met God, but they think they have. They just have an ideology. They have a superficial understanding of Christianity but they don't have a personal experience of the holiness of God. So it's mostly true that most people who think they are born again are not born again. However, the Holy Scriptures also speak many times, for example, in the book of Hebrews, in the book of Romans, and many other places. And in the words of Jesus himself, in John 15 and other places, the Holy Scriptures show that we can be in the grace of God and we can fall away from the grace of God, the book of Galatians in the first chapter, Paul says, I marvel that you are so soon removed from him, from God, who called you into the grace of Christ. God called them and they were in and then they were removed from God. It cannot be simpler than this. And basic words are being ignored when it comes to the truth because people want to protect that doctrine. I know that the devil has one objective with all these doctrines, and that is to convince people that they can keep living in deliberate sin and still be saved. So when somebody says that to me, I know that deep down, they just want to have a false sense of security. They want to believe that they can still be saved even if they walk in deliberate sin, or if they allow themselves a little bit of sin. So I know that it's all about sin. It's all about disobedience. So my answer to people who say, if somebody is living in deliberate sin, they were never safe to begin with. My answer is, I accept. I believe the same as you do, as long as you apply this to yourself. So ask yourself questions. Are you truly living in holiness or are you living in deliberate sin? If you are living in deliberate sin, then you are not saved. It doesn't matter how many times you think God has revealed himself to you. If you are living in deliberate sin, that means you never met God and you were never saved to begin with. This would be my answer to people who say that. Because most people who say that, they are living in deliberate sin. Most people who say that, they just want to excuse the doctrine. But they don't want to apply their own statement to themselves which is, they were never saved to begin with. And that's even if the Holy Scriptures clearly show that somebody can be in the grace of God and fall away from the grace of God. I hope this message answers you, brother, and may God bless you.